everyone, this is Janae. Long time no talk. I know, it's been ridiculous. Um, I haven't made a video in a few months, but I am back, and I thought the best way to get back into it is with a wonderful haul. I've gotten a lot of stuff over the last month or so, um, so I'm not sure how much of that I can fit into this video, but I will um, give it my best shot. First of all, as well, I want to thank all of my new subscribers uh, that I got, even in my absence. Um, thank you for subscribing, and hopefully you continue to enjoy my, my channel. And um, thank you for all my, you know, subscribers, period, all, all of you guys, um, for hanging in there. And I am back to it. I have some projects that I've made over the last month or so. Um, I've been watch catching up on everybody's videos. So I am just going to get to it. First thing I have is some new stamps I got, and these are from Banana Fish Studios. They come like this. Um, she just put some. Sorry for the noise. I'll just pull out one so you can see them. They're already mounted, um, and these are pretty. I mean, this is only maybe an inch and a quarter long by like half an inch, so. It's pretty tiny. And that one says, sorry for the lighting. We are having some gloomy, gloomy weather. But uh, that one says in review. So what I did is I just stamped them out. So you guys can see them. So there's a camera. Little thing says love lives here. Um, hello weekend. That's just one hello weekend. I just stamped it like twice. Um, hello today and in review. So again, those are from Banana Fish Studio. I got them months ago. Um, so... Yeah, you can go check out her store. Okay, and these things are in no particular order, and they're all mixed up. So I just really need to get them put away. Um, I got this from Archivers, and this is the uh, washi tape, three-roll washi tape from the uh, Find Your Wings and Fly, my mind's eye collection. Sorry for this glare. Let's see. Turn on this light. Hopefully that helps. Um, I really like that one right there. So I got that. Uh, what else? What else? What else? I got this Hero Arts background stamp. I have a birthday card uh, that I have in mind for this, so that's why I got this. I think this might be older. I'm not sure. I got it off of eBay. Um, so I got that, and it's called uh, I don't know what it's called. Number pattern. There you go. Hmm, makes sense. <laughs> So there's that. Um, let's see. Oh, from Tailored Expressions. This is uh, I got this stamp, the single stamp. Looks like that. It's red rubber, um, and it's a cling stamp, and it comes mounted. And this is what it says. And I had stamped it out and embossed it. These are for my Father's Day cards, or at least some of them. So that's what it says. And this I just have embossed in silver. So. There's that one, and again, that's from Tailored Expressions. She makes some really cool stamps. Um, there's another birthday one I really want to, but I don't think she had it in stock at the time. Um, let's see. More washi. I think I got this off of Etsy. It's the Boy Crazy washi from My Mind's Eye. And I really like that chevron, and I've already used these stars, and they're really pretty. So there's that. I'm sure everybody's seen that. Um... Oh, there's the other part to this. Bear with me. I'm just trying to get slightly more organized here for you. Um, got these Maggie Holmes uh, canvas frames. Everybody's seen them. There they are. They're really cute. And they have, like, stitching. And I like them because they're, like, actually big enough for, like, you know, if you have a 4 by 6 picture, you can put it down to 4 by 4 and it, you can actually use the frame. So I really like that. Um, no, I wasn't a huge fan of the rest of the collection, but anyway, I got that. And I got these slide, what do they call slide frames from the Crate Paper Pier collection. Um, there are 27 pieces in here. I know a lot of people have these too, so nothing too special. Again, the Pier collection, I know it's a summer collection, but for some reason those colors in that collection just aren't, um, grabbing me. Or something I don't know uh, let's see a couple Amy tangerine things I had gotten from 
Simon Says Stamp. I got these um, precision pen or not precision pens. These are slick riders from Amy Tangerine and those lovely colors. And I have the let's see the black and brown that I use all the time. So I um, decided I'd try these out because they're the same thing. They were all by American Craft. So and these work really really well. So I'm excited to use these. I got the uh, stamp set from uh, Amy Tangerine Yes Please, I think these are from. So, again, nothing too special. These stamps, though, aren't super high quality. If if you have them, you know that. Um, so you do have to, like, kind of prep them for ink. So I, I either use, sometimes I use an eraser, or I use uh, my, like, sanding block. So, and then they stamp fine. So, and then I had gotten these because I... Uh, I didn't have them, and I didn't see them anywhere else. So these are like the, the Yes Please stickers from Amy Tangerine, but they're the kind of translucent ones. You can kind of see through them a bit. And they have this side. I know a lot of people have seen these, so I'll do that part fast. Let's see. From Archivers. Yeah, like I said, I'm going to jump all around. No, yeah, I'm going to jump all around because these things are in no particular order, but I do remember where they're from at least, so that's a good thing. From Archivers, I got this Hero Art stamp, and it's called, it's called, I don't know, Hero Arts. It's a birthday set. Huh, doesn't say. It's a birthday set. It has some really cute sentiments. And it has that, I don't know if you can see that, but that, um, like those dotted letters in that one. So, just some cute sentiments. And I used my coupon on this. And that's Hero Arts. And paper smooches. Again, I got these because this is for an actual... Uh, these are the... These are called numbers. And these are called digits. And these are for a birthday card that I had in mind. So, these were bought specifically for some, a project. So, it's that. And... That. Um, from I think I got these off of Amazon. Um, yeah, nothing too special. Just the lifestyle crafts. Is it lifestyle crafts? Yeah, nesting rings, and I've already used them, so they're kind of jumbled in here. But um, I have a lot. I have you know I do have the silhouette, and I have some other uh, circle dies, but. Uh, I, I really like these. These do something a little different. They not only give you the inner, but they give you the actual ring, which is, which is nice. So I got that. And just these um, embossing plates. Chevron. Or this one's Chevron. And this one's that... Um, uh, I don't remember. I don't remember the name of the pattern, but you know what that pattern is. So you can't see that side, but that's what I got. Okay, from Joann's, let's see, I just got two more embossing folders. Apparently I'm really into embossing folders right now. I, I hadn't bought them for a while, but now I guess game on, who knows. But these are, this is the love triangle one. Um, and I got these from Joann's, they were, I think they were on sale and then I got an extra 25% off. Uh, I think it was Memorial Weekend. That's the triangles. And this one is Cross My Heart. That's pretty. And this one has the, I guess they both have the border. But this one's a little bit bigger. So there's that. And then Joanne also has, they had their thickers on sale. So I just got three packs. These are old. This is the Amy Tangerine. Yeah, I think these are the Amy, an old Amy Tangerine uh, collection. And then the hardcover in gold, which I have, but... They were 40% off with an extra 25 cents. So I got them. And then Sentiment in Silver. Got that. I don't remember where I got these from. I think these must have been from an Etsy store. It's just the Mint Julep uh, Blue Chipboard Letters. I think people have shown these. and I haven't used them yet, so i got to get cracking with them. I do like that blue. Not a fan of the other papers, but I like that. What's my time? Okay. And then a 6x6 pad. I think I got it off one of the Etsy stores. It might have been Paper Issues or Share Bear Crafts. But the All About a Boy collection. People have seen this. It's super cute. I just picked up the uh, 12x12 today from Hobby Lobby. So I was pretty excited. 
And from Archivers, I got the 24-7 6x6 pad from Simple Stories. I'm not a huge Simple Stories fan, but the colors in this are really nice. They're really masculine, so I like that. Perfect for cards. That's what I bought it for more than anything. So, the 24-7 collection by Simple Stories. And Archivers, I just gotten these two pack of thickers. I don't usually buy um, thickers from Archivers because, uh, yeah, they're expensive. They're, I mean, you, you pay full price, $5 a pack. So, um, yeah, I don't usually do this. I just got two packs. And this is just because I don't, I haven't seen these anywhere else, I guess. This is the kitten font, and it's in like a foil blue. I think it's foil. Yeah, foil letters. So I just thought it was a cool font. You get a ton of letters. And this one is also in the kitten font, and it's just printed chipboard, black and white. So that was Archivers. Got these from Freckle Fawn. Everybody's seen them. These are the clouds, the whatever, and whatever. I'm addicted to that cloud. Love that cloud. And I have the Heidi Swap Ghost Letters, which I think I got from Share Bear Crafts on Etsy. So got those. Uh, let's see. Oh, I got a $5 grab bag from, sorry for the noise, from, where is it? Freckle Fun uh, of Washi. So you get, you got four Washies for $5. And these, and you didn't get to pick them. It was a surprise when I got them in the mail. So it's this one here, this diagonal blue and green. This like turquoise -y party. This orange and white chevron. Love it. And this neon orange. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with this one, but eh. maybe do a giveaway or something if I don't use that. I'm not sure I'm going to use that. Well, whatever. Let's see. Um, from the I think these were from this stuff. TJ Maxx had some thickers, so I got the two pack of the Fellow in black and white, dollar forty nine a piece. Uh, one pack of the Sunrise in that, uh, like a palish green, pale neonish green, I guess. Um, the sprinkles in glitter, just the numbers. And these were all a dollar forty nine from TJ Maxx. Two of the emerald in flocked letters. Emerald, that's the font there and two of the macaws what's this thing oh two of the macaws in uh glitter just white glitter so i got those from good old tj maxx and then oh this is a stray joanne thing from the hey you collection the banners i had gotten when i went to joanne's i think that should do it for now I have a few more things to show, but that needs to be in another video because I don't want to get this one too long. Um, thank you all for watching and continue to watch because I have projects I've done. I've been I've been scrapbooking, um, and I'll share those with you. And yeah, and in a couple videos, kind of tell you kind of where I've been. But all is well. We're doing well, and. Uh, it's just rainy, rainy, rainy in Tennessee. So uh been kind of a weird beginning to summer. So hopefully we get some consistent sunny days um, and get out and enjoy some of the uh, summer activities. So I hope everybody's having a wonderful weekend. And that's it. We'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.